Zakari. Took your land. He took your, your your heritage. He called you something that you wasn't. He called you savages. He called you Indians. You're not even from India, bro. And there's nothing savage about you. You're you seem like a nice guy. You seem like a nice guy. Why they call you a savage? While they was raping, robbing, and murdering, they called you the savage. That don't make you angry. You said this is my land. You're right. But he took it from you. Don't that make you angry? That's John 10 and 10. There you go. John 10 and 10, man. How long, how long have you known you, was, you were in Israel? Uh, about five years. Five years? All crazy. What, what tribe are you from? Uh, Judah. Judah, okay. Just like my brother here, there, and right there. Uh, a, lot of, a lot of the Akim say I look like uh, from Zebulon. A little bit. You know? A little bit. <laughs> yeah, like, he, he got he gets some similar, uh, yeah, John, some John. similar remarks. This car, you from? Yeah, yeah. Me, myself, and this brother here were Levites. You know what I'm but twelve tribes, we all the same nation. Who, who have you uh, primarily been learning under? GMS. GMS? Okay. Okay. G you know GMS is out here, right? Yes. Yeah. Okay. I teach you. Oh, you do? Yeah. Okay. 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 Right. I don't know. He oh. actually just uh, wrapped up camp right now. Oh yeah. yeah. Y'all still downtown? Uh, no, 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 no. We're in an undisclosed location. Okay. Because the COVID? Okay. Okay. So. Alright, yeah, okay. That's what's up, man. That's what's up. But it, it's cool. A lot of people right here, especially when they hear this word, right? Absolutely. I take this route home. You know what I'm saying? Wow, wow. Hey, man, all crazy, man. Hey, man. It's, it's always a beautiful thing when brothers can get together and recognize that we is, bro. And, and, and be peaceable because but I'll tell you this right one, one thing I don't like though is the division that's a one stitch right you know what I'm saying yeah yeah I don't like exactly all, all came from the school of one west yeah exactly see what I'm saying I don't know why different philosophies and shit get incorporated it's, it's not good I think some Which, of it has to do with egos and it creates division right you know? A lot of people say we, uh, we praise the elders and this and that. No, we show honors, honor to the elders. Just the scriptures say to show honor to the elders. Honors. That's right. Yeah. Hey man, that's a beautiful thing because I, I, for the camera's sake, I won't name the camp that I'm referring to, but there is a camp. Uh, they got a school somewhere down this way, yeah. and uh, if you know who they I are, know who you're yeah, okay. About. <laughs> You know, hey, we see a, we see a lot of brothers and sisters coming back and forth from the school to the school. About half of them, shalom, shalom, peaceable, yeah. cool. The other half, hey, bro, come on, man. Hey, hey, the other thing is the name. Yeah. Well, there's only one name under heaven. You can be saved by. Exactly. And you can't bless. They're not blaspheming. Yeah, exactly. There's they're certain mm -hmm. corporations and organizations who won't promote the name. Yeah. Jalapeno peppers, or y'all play yogurt? Yeah, y'all play yogurt. Yeah, you know who I'm talking yeah. about. Yeah, <laughs> I know exactly who you're talking about. That's that's it. That's no fly zone. But yeah, man, what Lord willing, Lord willing, they repent. Whoever on that, you know, hey, Elder Tahar, I heard him say it himself. He believed that man, a man of the Lord. He just need to repent. Huh? Huh? I, I tend to agree, man, I, and I and I hope he does. Because huh? huh? playing with fire. It's not safe, man. Right. That's right. That's right. That's right. And, and the Lord doesn't take pleasure in destroying us. So I'm not going to take pleasure in seeing another brother go down that path to get destroyed. But, you know, sometimes it's just going to be that way because the Bible does say two-thirds got to be cut off. 
So at the end of the day, there's nothing we can do about that. You know, Lord. Yes. Well. Hey, there's, there's no worse death I can even think of than yeah. the second death. Yeah. I don't want that. Hey, the first one was fucked up. Bro. <laughs> the first one was bad. Why you think Judah can't swim now? Oh man. <laughs> That's a spiritual thing. Uh, hey man, you know, you know Levi. Levi be out there on the dolphins and the, the tires. <laughs> <laughs> Give me something. Let's go to Revelation 13 and 9, man. Why not? Yes. Why not? Beautiful. Just give me Beautiful. something. <laughs> Book of Revelation, chapter 13, verse 9. If any man have an ear, let him hear. He that leadeth in the captivity shall go in the captivity. See, so if you got ears, you can hear this. If you have understanding or wisdom, you can understand this. Understand this. Exactly. Understand this right here. Yeah. He that leadeth into captivity shall go into captivity. Hey, hey, Deuteronomy uh, 30 and 7. Let's get it. Let's get it. Hold on, what you got? Let's get Deuteronomy 30 and 7. And yeah, this goes for the, the nations. Come on, come on. Deuteronomy 30 and 7. And the Lord thy God will put all these curses upon thine enemies. And on them that hate thee, which cross, which persecute thee. You see that? And that and that uh, Gadite brother didn't want to hear that, because these nations they they hate us, and they persecute us, and God's gonna put curses on them. All right. And thou shalt, and thou shalt return and obey the voice of the Lord and do all His commandments, which I command thee this day. And that's all we're telling our people to do: to return to the Most High God, keep these commandments. But they don't want to hear it. They don't want to hear none of it. How you doing today, brother? You doing all right, Ken? And you know, you know, uh, Black Specs, Native Americans, God's chosen people, right? We don't know that about you. Man, I see. Him. I that's see. That's not Zachariah. That's two thirds right there. Hey, well, hey, I gotta get the blood off my hands. I gotta at least let them know. I gotta at least let them know. Hey, keep these blood statues and commandments, man. Repent, be converted. Now, why would Christ tell Israelites to repent and be converted if this is for everybody? Because Israelites is doing the wrong thing, man. Jake is messing up. Out. For for Jake to be able to read this Bible, have this Bible in their house, their whole life, talk about, oh yeah, I, I, I believe in the Bible, I follow the Word, I read the Bible. And you're not scared. You're not scared to go break the Sabbath. Man, he not, says it's a perfect thing. Exactly. <laughs> you, come on, man, you're not you're not scared to go commit adultery. You're not scared to go murder your brother and sell him some drugs. Oh man, look, Ecclesiastes uh, 12 and 13, man. We're supposed to fear Yahweh and keep his commandments, man. That's the whole, that's the whole, whole, the duty, whole of duty of man. It's the only <laughs> reason we even here. Look, so if you're not doing that, what are you doing? You're worthless. You're just taking up space. We are here to serve the Most High God. These jakes out here is as good as a broken TV set. Why, why is it in my house if it don't work? That's what it's there for. It's there so I can watch it, right? We are here so we can serve the Most High God. We we act like a we act like a wicked woman that run around on her damn man. Harlot. Like a harlot, man. Absolutely. Absolutely. So bring it out. From the Proverbs chapter 27 and 12. A prudent man foreseeth the evil and hideth himself, but the simple pass on and are punished. You see that the prudent man will spot evil, don't want nothing to do with that. The simple, they run it right into it. And, and, Jay, and Jake's make fun of that stuff all the time, man. Look, I grew up watching stand-up comedy, right? Every black stand-up would talk about white people in horror movies versus black people in horror movies. Black people here are bumping the night in a haunted house. I'm out of here. White people are, oh, what was that? Let's go investigate. <laughs> well, that's how Jake acts when it comes to wickedness. Yeah. Jake goes, oh, what, there's wickedness going on over there? Let me go see what this is about. The prudent man would get away from that. The prudent man don't want to be over there mixing up with them. Unless it's to, you know, let them know something, but don't do what they're doing. You know I'm saying, Yahweh Shai, he, he, he dallied with, you know, with, with lowly people, but it was to edify. When they didn't get it, shake the dust off and keep it moving. Keep it moving, man. Go ahead. Proverbs 29, uh, 
Christ like at 16 when the wicked are multiplied transgress transgression increases it increases but the righteous shall see their fall see that? the righteous are going to see the fall of the wicked man the righteous are going to see the fall of the wicked and the wicked don't even see it coming that's the cold part about it We're, we literally come out here week in and week out you know whether it's the Sakarion Dunlap in 19 or GMS or 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 um I don't even know if IUIC be going out like that, but they got a school. <laughs> they got a school. I know ISBK out here somewhere. Brothers is going out, and at the very least, disagreements aside, right? At the very least, we telling our people, you are the Israelites. Keep the commandments. Come back to the Lord. You're gonna be destroyed. And they still not gonna see it coming because they don't even hear it. It goes in one ear and out the other. You know what I'm saying, Brothers, hey, hey, brother, brother in the Hawaiian shirt. My brother, how you doing, man? You got a second? Can I talk to you for a second? Nah, really? You had enough time to buy a black and mild, though. You can't, you can't, you can't hear the word for a second. That's crazy. All right, well, hey. Hey, we just brought that out. We just brought that out. Hey, man, that's crazy. They closed their ear, man. But look, when when, when his calamity comes, what's he gonna be saying? Oh God! Oh God! Oh God, make some time for me. Oh he couldn't make no time to hear the word. Oh God, why is this happening? <laughs> Bring it out, man. Uh, it's book of Amos 3 and I start at 6. Surely a trumpet be blown in the city and the people and the people not be afraid. Shall, shall there be evil in a city and the Lord hath not done it? See that? Yeah, hold, hold that. Because a lot, uh, our people are, are, are lost, man. They Christians, man. They say, look, whenever something good happened to them, something that they like, they say, oh man, God has blessed me. But whenever something happened that they don't like, what they say? The devil trying to get me. The devil trying to hold me down. Nah, man, God is jacking you up because you're not doing what you're supposed to be doing. Read. Surely the Lord God will do nothing but he revealeth his secrets unto his servants, the prophets. See that? And that's why we out here to tell our people what's what. But they want to get offended and run up the block whenever we tell them who their enemy actually is. They don't want to hear that. They want to hear it some, some just, it's just purely metaphysical. Oh, it's a, it's a demon named Satan. He's the only one that's against me. No. God has a people and Satan got his people too, goddammit. The white man is the devil according to the Bible. That's right. And there's no way around that. How you doing, brother? It's good to see you again. Yeah. My brother Gad. You love God? Yeah. After? Yeah. Well, how do you show that you love God? Yeah. You believe him every day? You keep his word every day? Do you keep all his commandments? Man, that's what's up. That's what's up. But you got to keep those commandments, though. You know that, right? You know? Okay. Okay, I'm just making sure you know, man. You can't be out here eating shrimp, crab, pork, and lobster. That's right! You can't be out here uh, uh, sleeping with other men's wives, being homosexuals, doing drugs, selling drugs. I was going to say shaving beers, but Gad don't usually got to worry about that. <laughs> Drinking too much is bad too. You can drink. You hey, can have some fun. Scriptures talk about uh, getting your neighbor uh, drunk. Right. You know, that's exactly what it's talking about. Exactly. Take their land, break down the curtain, and take them to the And pacify them with that fire water, man. Right? And, that, and that's why we see Gad all up and down these streets. Just destroy, man. You know how many Gad ice we done seen stagger out in the traffic when the light was going? The Lord must have been with him a little bit that he didn't get hit. He let him out of safe or something else. He is. That's, he is. A, that's a diabetes. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, we talked to him about his missing leg before. He's been up here before. Yeah. That's even at a abominable uh, meat. Uh. That's even at that shit you're not supposed to eat. Exactly. Exactly. Shoot, what am I... Uh, my pops is a, uh, an accountant, right? One of his clients, great shape, worked out, looked good for his age and all that. One day, he just started losing all this weight. All this weight, he looked like a starving Ethiopian on them, on them commercials with the singing white lady, right? 
didn't know what was happening so we went to the doctor the doctor told him he had like a, a whole army of tapeworms in his intestines Damn. It was Stopped eating pork, took whatever treatment he was supposed to take, and bounced right back. But our people don't want to hear that. Our people want the ham sandwich. They want the Hawaiian <laughs> pizza. You know, go ahead. This is Isaiah. This is Isaiah uh, uh, 30, and uh, I'll start at, at 9. That this is a rebellious people, lying children, children that will not hear the law of the Lord, which say to the seers, see not, and to the prophets, Prophesy not unto us right things. Speak unto us smooth things. So they see the seers, they see the prophets, they say, we don't want you to see. We don't want you to prophesy unto us right things. We want you to prophesy unto us smooth things. That's why they packed the damn churches. That's why Joel Osteen got football numbers in his churches. We have the prophets who come out and actually read the Bible, nobody want to hear it. Maybe, maybe a couple people here and there are passing. You know what I'm saying? Uh, unless it's some contention. We get to beefing with somebody, then all of a sudden here's a big old crowd. It's a crowd yeah. And it's a crowd. You know, but outside of that, you know, if it ain't no it ain't no ignorant stuff, Jake don't want to hear it. Keep going. Prophesied deceits. Get you out of the way. They say, they literally say bye to us. Prophesy deceits. Get you out of the way. Get up. What do they all say? Oh, don't y'all got jobs? What are y'all doing here? We we in the same place at the same time. Do you have a job? Don't worry about what I'm doing. That's what, that's what I'm saying. You know, I'm I'm here on Saturday. You here on Saturday. That was right. This is the living water. Yeah, he drank that. He gonna thirst again. Yeah. <laughs> uh, verse eleven. Get you out of the way. Turn aside out of out of the path, because the Holy One of Israel like, caused cause the Holy One of Israel to cease from before. It's like, cause the Holy One of Israel to cease from before. You know how cold that is. You know what kind of balls you gotta have to say, "Hey man, get your how up out of here." <laughs> tripping, tripping. Look, man. What? Look, man. I, I the way people's minds work. It just baffles me sometimes, man. It's like, you ever seen like a five foot nothing girl try to attack her six foot three husband? Like, what, like, what you think you was gonna do? If he hits you back, you're finished. You gonna talk bad about your howl? <laughs> For real, fatality. <laughs> Brutality. This is Jeremiah 4 and 22. For my people is foolish, they have no... Uh, Jeremiah 4 and 22 For my people is foolish They have not known me They are they are sodden children And they have none understanding They are wise to do evil yeah. But but to do good They have no knowledge yeah, to do good, they, have, they don't even know how to do good man. Jake, Jake will be a, 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 a Damn chemist A damn chemist in the damn trap house man <laughs> I can't, look, look, Family chemistry in school But well who cook up the purest, most potent drugs ever. You know what I'm saying? It's not, look, and they act like we dumb. We're not dumb. We just, we just want to do nigga shit. That's what we all it is. <laughs> you want to be sick? <laughs> that's it. I just want to do hood rat stuff with my friends. That's that's all, that's all Jake's on. Yeah, it ain't that we dumb. Like the end dumb. I want to do, uh, what is it, ball head hoes? Ball head hoes shit. Yeah. Yup. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. God. This is Amos 5 and 14. Seek good and not evil that ye may live, and uh, and so the Lord, the God of hosts, shall be with you as ye have spoken. So that we're supposed to seek good and not evil. Growing up, how many times did our friends come over to our house and say, hey, how can we please the Lord today? Hey, what, what law statute of commandments are we lacking in? Not never. No, none of my homies ever came over to my mama house talking like that. They came over to my mama house talking about, how you doing, miss? As soon as she went into her room, hey, nigga, where the hoes at? Hey, hey, where the bud at? Yeah. It's always, we, why is to do evil? We always seeking out the evil, man. We got to get up out of that. Go ahead. Verse 15. Hate the evil and love the good and establish judgment in the gates. The gates, man. We supposed to hate the evil and love the good? Yeah, man. Hey, real quick. Hey, miss. What, 
Miss, do you believe in the Bible? What, what's your nationality? What's that? Caucasian? Did you know that the Bible says that the Caucasians are evil? You know that? Right, right. And the Bible just said, hate the evil and love the good. So we hate you and we love our people. How do you feel about that? Do you hate your own people? Because your people are evil? Do you hate Caucasians? So you love the evil. You see, because that's what the devil would do. She love witchcraft. She love the warlocks. That's right. And she don't have it so. And she out here believing that a piece of cloth is going to protect her from an airborne disease. Come on, come on. Because that. Even, even when Jake be wearing the mask, they be keeping it down here. They got their nose all out. Of yeah, come on. They just got it on, so when they walk into the store, they be like, hey, you got to wear a mask. Well, okay. Just pull it up real quick. Just pull it right back down. They ain't stopping nothing. They ain't stopping nothing. Whole, whole eye sockets is exposed, but you know, right. airborne disease can't get through your mouth. Like that. That's great. And that's and that's how you know the white man's the devil, because it's the white man that told you that putting a damn handkerchief on your face is gonna protect you from that. It's crazy. Psalm 91, man. Psalm 91. If the if the most high God wants you to get that disease, your ass gonna get it. You gonna get it. And and if you if you please him, you serve him, it says no place gonna come to your door. Now let's get that real quick. You want something? 